Ocean phenomena you won't believe actually exist. The ocean is in fact not just the sea that you go to with your friends. The ocean is limitless. It had no end and it is a whole another world on its own. There are many oceans in our planet with many different characteristics and majestic beauty. If you have ever gone diving in an ocean, you have really gone through a one of a kind experience. The ocean could forever be explored, but still it would carry more secrets than no one knows about. The ocean is proof of mother nature's perfection in all its shapes. Nature lovers appreciate the ocean's serenity and its aggressive fluctuations. In other words, the ocean is a place where you can meditate in and a place that would make you feel so insignificant in front of its power. Since it is a mind-blowing topic, wait until we confront you with some ocean phenomena you won't believe actually exist. Before we begin, be sure to subscribe to Viral Now and hit the bell so you never miss an upload from us. Also, leave us a like right now. With this being said, let's start. Researchers are excellent at investigating new things and coming up with awesome discoveries which make a good material for our videos indeed. After you watch the coming up next wonders, you will be convinced that we will never stop learning more about the ocean and nature in general. 5. Underwater Crop Circles those circles that are found at the ocean floor are 7-foot diameter circles that were first discovered in 1995 in southern Japan. The coolest thing about that phenomenon is that it remains a mystery for many divers until our day. This is what makes it more attractive and impressive. They called these circles mystery circles. But anyway, what is responsible for that phenomenon? Or, in other words, who does that? Research has found out that there is a certain type of fish that is called puffer fish, but referred to as finned digger, makes these constructions. Cool. A fish engineer is a great thought, isn't it? Well, let's be more serious because those fish are hard workers and they are very organized as well as very committed and dedicated to finishing their constructions. Not only that, but also they make sure it looks captivating and fantastic. Males spend seven to nine days building their circles. How do they do that? They keep swimming in and out of the circle by digging in the sand using their fins. Moreover, they are good architects, I believe. They not only build a circle, but they also decorate it with shells and coral fragments. So eventually, you get a beautifully built and decorated crop circles. Do they do that for fun? No, they build those circles for a purpose. It is quite amazing to know that other creatures have purposes, not only human beings. So living with a purpose is something essential for every creature. Those circles actually serve as a nest. The male stirs up the sand in the middle of the circle and darts forth and back to grab a female puffer fish's attention. If she picked him as a mate, she laid her eggs in his circle. When the eggs are laid and hatched, the male abandons the circle forever. Then the mission is repeated several times for another mating season. Why would not he reuse his previous circle? The scientists believe that the circle would be no longer convenient to receive more eggs and would not provide them with the needed atmosphere to hatch. To be honest, this fish is more creative than most humans are. 4. Underwater Rivers So it is quite puzzling and amusing to realize that there are underwater rivers. So here is the ocean and beneath it, there is a river. Elaborate, please. The underwater river we are talking about now is located in Mexico. Its name is Canode Angelita, which means little angel. In this ocean, a thin layer of hydrogen sulfate separates the fresh water from the salt water beneath it. Scuba divers could easily swim in this marvelous creation which looks like a normal river, but this one is under the sea. Take me to Mexico, please. What is more? There are some trees in that underwater river and leaves which make the seascape look magnificent and surreal. It is more of a usual river there with its tree branches and so on. When you look from the top, you will only see the normal deep blue color of the water. But when you take a closer look, you will start to see what it really looks like down there. It might sound imaginary because its beauty is beyond imagination indeed. However, it might be a little bit scary or eerie because it is foggy and you can start hallucinating. So make sure you have your oxygen equipments working perfectly because when you go down there, it is going to take forever to explore this fantastic phenomenon. Can you go fishing there? I think it would be way easier than fishing on land only if there were any fish there in that underwater river. Well, I also think you are pretty safe enough there. No sharks would disturb you in the fresh water. How interesting, but so dark. Absolutely recommended to explore and take some photos there. Man, this ocean must be a very successful tourist attraction site. People would come from all over the world to swim in the underwater river because it is not something you can find in every ocean. It is a rare phenomenon or perhaps it just only one. 
three. When fresh water meets salty water, is it possible? Who said it is not? It is very possible and it happens. There is a natural phenomenon that happens when the river's fresh water meets the tidal seawater. This interaction leads to the creation of what is known as estuarine circulation and salt concentration flux, in short, estuaries. There is a difference between the density of the fresh water and the salty water. When the river and the sea meet, the lighter water, the rivers, rises up and above the heavier dense water, the seas. This leads to mixing both the salty and the fresh water. They sit on top of one another, creating a line that separates the fresh water from the salty water. How impressive! Nature functions so well and it seems like different natural forces get along easily. Perhaps we can learn something from nature, right? So can divers really swim there? Absolutely they can, but they will look as if they are flying when they shift from the sea to the river because they would be leaving a type of water to move into a different type of water with different density and characteristics. It is an amazing natural phenomenon and it is an evidence of how this universe is filled with magnificence. The ocean does not stop surprising us. It mingles with rivers and even the sun just wait for it. Two green flash. Even though this is a sunset phenomenon, you can never see it unless there is an ocean. So that makes it an ocean phenomenon as well, right? So let's start. A green flash occurs during sunset and mostly also during sunrise. It only lasts a second or two and that is why it is called a flash. You can observe that part of the sun's color is changing for a moment from orange or red during sunset. Nature is just amazing and all of the natural forces are in harmony with each other. They complete each other and they produce a fantastic outcome which attracts our eyes and makes us wonder how something could be as beautiful and overwhelming. If you think perfection does not exist, just watch how nature functions. It is enough evidence for perfection and wholeness. It is true that nature has a healing power and something as great as the green flash leaves you a room to meditate and appreciate this world's creation. During the occurrence of this phenomenon, the atmosphere would act as a prism to refract the sunlight and separate it into many different colors. I think you can start to imagine how it looks like. Why is it called green in particular? Because the most visible color is green because there are other light rays that are emitted during this phenomenon that cannot be seen by the naked eye. Sometimes there are shades of blue that are also visible, but the green shade is the most common hue. But nature is unexpected and you never know, maybe different colors will be visible. As we mentioned before, to get a clear view of the green flash, you have to be at the ocean because it happens frequently there. What a scenery that is worth gazing at. Have you seen it before? Do not miss this chance. 1. Bioluminescence This natural phenomenon in particular would make you amazed. The ocean is just a fantastic area of research. You will never get bored with what you will discover every time you want to explore. Do you know fireflies? We mostly see their sparkle in the night at summer. Ever thought why do they look like that? Basically because they have glowing abdomens which make them produce light. This process of emitting the light through a chemical reaction is known as bioluminescence. Okay, so that takes place on land. What would prevent it from taking place in sea? So yes, this happens also in seascape. There are seascapes that glow and emit light exactly just like fireflies. How is that possible? Do not forget that there are many sea creatures that glow and glitter. There are some types of fish produce light to lure their preys and some type of squids produce bioluminescent liquid instead of ink just to distract its predators. Moreover, some sea worms and crustaceans emit light when they want to impress and attract a mate. So of course, all of this light reflects on the seascape around the marine organisms so it looks as shiny and glittery. I think it is an awesome phenomenon because it feels like there is a party down there at the bottom of the ocean. It feels less eerie and when you dive there, you will be able to see clearly and just feel amazed with all the shiny creatures you will come across. I will break some good news to you now. You do not have to dive to marvel at the beautiful phenomenon because those glowing creatures exist starting from the surface of the water to the seafloor, so snorkeling would do. Of course, there are hundreds of amazing natural phenomena, whether at the ocean, the land, or even the sky. The universe in general is probably a majestic natural phenomenon. Mother Nature is at its best the farther you are from pollution and the city. You will be impressed with how nature functions. Don't you ever feel like you want to go on a meditation trip all alone? Imagine camping in front of an ocean all alone and just ready to gaze at the deep blue water and hear the waves crashing. 
It is guaranteed that you will discover many outstanding natural phenomena taking place every minute. Nature is rich in wonders, and the ocean in particular is vivid with breathtaking sceneries and marine organisms. If you are good at diving, you will definitely be more excited about watching our video to explore the ocean and marvel at its splendid phenomena. Now it is your turn to tell us what do you think of those previous impressive ocean phenomena that actually exist. Have you ever experienced one? If you have, tell us in the comment section before what you saw. And if you have not, also tell us which phenomenon overwhelmed you and you wish to experience it one day.